love you over my show. Hello, hello. Say hello everyone and welcome back to your favorite channel, the Obama Show. It's been a really long time. Alhamdulillah, we're back. And uh, by the way, let me wish you a happy new year. May 2021 be a year of success, a year of health, wealth, and all uh, the happiness. But above all, may we share the blessing of this new year with our families and friends. So today we are um, at Mr. Ben Center. I have the honor and the privilege to come and see my brother and the tremendous job he's doing uh, for the English language and uh, for the whole community of ELT in Senegal. So let's get started. Thank you so much, uh, and I'm so delighted to talk to the viewers of uh, the Obama Show, who is like our show. I, I used to say that Obama Show is our show, and then this is the show for all, all the all the English lovers. So he, welcome here in uh, uh, English and Languages Center for Leadership and Entrepreneurship, known as uh, Mr. Ben Center. Okay, welcome for all and everything. That Thank you very much for the warm welcome. Uh, my, my brother, Hassan, appreciated a lot because we, we were given so, so much uh, good treats and Hassan, he likes it. Okay. All right, so my first question, I mean, there are a lot of questions going around Mr. Ben Sander, but the first one I'm going to ask you is, where did the idea come from? Okay, thank you. This idea, this is a good question, and, and I'm so delighted to answer to this question. Uh, people know, uh, know Mr. Ben through like the community work that I have been doing so far into my community in Medina Fall. I have been working for a long time to help like people learn about English. And I have uh, helped many people, formal and non-formal uh, students, to learn about the English language. And uh, I was doing things in a formal, informal way. And I, it comes to my mind that I have to create a formal way uh, activities, like doing, creating a kind of center. And this center is just the culmination of the good things that I was, ha that I have been doing so far into my community. And I like it comes to my mind. Why not creating a center for like welcoming people and helping like a, a large group of people that may come here? That's the reason why we create here. Uh, I took something like one year to see if ever it might be possible to do it, and I see that it was really possible. And I and I and I go forward for the this center, and I create uh, Mr. Ben Center, welcoming formal and non-formal people. All right, and. Uh, uh, let's admit, Mr. Ben Center is not the first center in chess. Uh, there have been so many centers before, and Mr. Ben Center came. So what makes Mr. Ben Center different from the other centers? Why people should come to Mr. Ben Center? Very good. Good question. So in English, we say variety is a spice of life. If ever you see every person doing the same thing, you should not do the same thing. You should try and uh, be very original. That's the reason why whenever we create this center, it's not only for an, a center for English. And the name is English and Languages Center for Leadership and Entrepreneurship. Why people should come in Mr. Ben Center? It's because Mr. Ben Center target two uh, people, formal students and non-formal students. For formal students, we think that uh, we have a better way of teaching English because teaching is a matter of art and the teacher or an artist, okay? We have been dealing with a lot with the teaching of English. And here, for formal students and non-formal students, we help with the English language first, but we help as well with other trainings like leadership, entrepreneurship, uh, computering. Uh, uh, we help with the service learning activities. We help like those people who are here to like uh, show to other people that here is a place to be, but helping those people to be more close to their community. In a sense then, if ever they are learning even, they will serve their community, whether they are professionals, whether they are Taliban children, whether they are Arabic students, whether they are whatever. This is the reason why I think that here is the place to be. Okay. And uh, as you said, you are teaching not just English, mm -hmm. Uh, but why did you choose the, 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 the English word center or Mr. Ben Center as the name of the, the center? The basic why did is. You choose a French, yes. French name? No, the basic is in English. Okay. 
English is the basic. In everything that we are doing, it's in English. Because we think that uh, a language center might not be only for English. Some people may choose English. It's good, but we, we think that we can choose English plus something else. And that something else is we can give the chance to other people saying that I want to choose, for example, French, or I want to choose Spanish, but I want to choose, we will say, no, welcome. You will choose French, but you will add English as well. Because English is a basic, and then we are like helping people through English languages, but also whenever they decide to learn something else, we will help them as well to learn as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, are you giving classes only here, or you have uh, coaching classes and home classes yes. for, for people we, who cannot make it? We have three different types of classes. Home classes, we have also classes at the center, and some uh, also classes, online classes. Through Zoom, classroom, uh, Google Classroom, WhatsApp, Skype, and all those like tools that may help us to, 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 to teach as well. Okay. Yeah. So today we have come myself and uh, the team of the Obama Show to yeah. visit um, the center yeah. and see what you're doing here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, for the first thing, I just uh, congratulate you just for coming, and uh, I'm welcoming you also in this uh, in this center. Here we just try to coach. Okay, I'm not teaching, but coaching, just guide our students in order to improve their level in English. And uh, in this center, I think that uh, we, have, we have started all the, um, the courses, what you call the reinforce, okay, the, the students' level in a certain, in a certain way. Okay. Yeah. Right. And, and here we just try not just to give what it is supposed to do in the class, but how to communicate, because I just try here, like the communicative speaking, uh, also grammar, vocabulary, but how to also see how to communicate. Right. That is very important, because right. language is first the speaking. Okay, and how long have you been uh, giving classes here? Just uh, four months, just four months. We have been teaching here just for four months, okay. yeah. What do you think uh, are the things that make this center stand out? Uh, it means that uh, the hospitality that we have, the environment also is very uh, welcoming. And uh, also the management from Mr. Byrne, okay, who give us all the material that we need in order just to improve our teachings. I think it's very important for uh, uh, what you call teaching and, and, and learning. Thank you very much. It's been it's been a pleasure it's to see you. Pleasure for me. Oh, my pleasure, sir. Thank you. All right. All right. Hello. Hello. Uh, what's your name? My name is Fat Wad. Fat Wad. Uh, are you a student here? Yes, I'm a student in MBC Center. Okay. Uh, since when have you been member uh, a student of uh, uh, Mr. Ben Center? Um, I'm in MBC Center since uh, the holidays, and uh, I'm joining it by the way by my sister. She is the wife of Mr. Ban, and he told me that uh, Mr. Ban are you know, a new uh, school, yes, a new center named the NBC Center, and she told me that to enter the center, and so I, I come here to learn English and other matters. Okay. And are you satisfied with the, the training you are getting? Yes, I'm very satisfied because uh, uh, when I'm when my in my first time here, I don't really know some notion in English, but now I really can uh, speak English. Uh, and I can do some exercise on English, and I can explain myself. I can present myself, for example. In a school, people really remark that my uh, level English is high this uh, year. So I really am really satisfied for MBC Center. Okay. And what do you say to those people who are watching you and who want to speak English like you? Um, I want to tell them that to enter the MBC Center, if they want to explain in English, and if they want to be uh, not the is the most important person who can say in the if they want to say English and develop their English they come they need to come here because in MBC Center in MBC Center we have some uh, professors and they can help them mm -hmm. to success in their English that they want thank you very much okay, what's your name I go by the name of Maget Sambu Maget Sambu Maget where do you live I live in Jahal do you like Mr. Ben Center Yes, of course. Uh, what can you tell me about uh, the center? Uh, Mr. Van Center is uh, a good center because he he helped me to 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 uh, to speak the to speak English and many languages. 
Thank you very much. That's comment C'est papa Tierno Ser. Je viens intervenir ici pour faire cours avec les élèves en seconde et en terminale, aussi en première S. Okay. Et pourquoi vous n'apprenez pas l'anglais maintenant Bon, c'est une langue que j'ai abandonnée depuis fort longtemps, donc raison pour laquelle j'ai un peu perdu la langue. Okay. Et quel message avez-vous pour ceux qui veulent apprendre l'anglais et qui sont à Thiès Bon, qu'ils n'ont qu'à venir à Mr. Ben Center. Right. Okay. Thank you very much. All right. So, Mr. Ben, we are uh, about to, to leave and we have had so, you know, wonderful moments with your students and your uh, staff. So, what is your final, final message and uh, your wishes for the new year? Yeah, thank you so much, brother. I, I am very delighted today. I'm so, so, so happy. Because having you here, not only for visiting was enough, but you came and then you show me that this is your place. And you came as well, you came and then you, you, you were like, as, a, as, a, as all English lovers, talking to students and making things very easy. I'm, I'm so delighted and I'm so happy. I just wanted to thank you. I just wanted to thank all the followers of uh, the Obama show and tell them that we English teachers, we should be more than English teachers. We should be committed teachers, as you may, you used to say. And here, it's not for the sake of having money, because as I explained to you, many of the students, they come here for free. They, we even do not talk about uh, paying. We talk about payment. We talk, talk about uh, participations. Why participations? Because every single money that someone gives us, we will pay the renting, and then we will like, uh, help some, some, some people, like some needy people, like those who are in Doris, those who are in mosque, those who are in the mosque, and those who are in needy situations. This is what we do. And here, I think that this is a good place where people may come and learn. Because as you may mention, we have all subjects, but English is a basis, as I used to say. This is a language center. This is also a place where, for knowledge, it's a place where people come and try and uh, like sh like make things in a very easy way, and then showing people that in every person lay a light. It's up to that person to put that light up or down, as Sehanta Job used to say. And I'm so happy to welcome you here. I'm, I'm very, 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 very happy. I wish um, a good success to all like the followers of uh, the Obama show. And we English lovers, we are so proud of you. What you are doing is fantastic. And then we really pray for you. May I uh, reward you for all the things that you are doing so far. May Allah be with you anytime, wherever, whenever. May Allah make ease, like everything that you are doing then. For you, your family, your brothers, your sisters, all the English lovers, we are so happy. And the best is yet to come. Because I think the future of English in Senegal relies on the hands of like, those wonderful people that we have as English teachers or English students. This is what I have to say, because I may say that my heart is so full of longing today. And I, I pray for you. I pray for all the wonderful guys which are like, who might be watching this. And I pray for you all and really know that I'm, I'm so happy today. Thank you, brother. Thank it's you so much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank I'll see you soon. Everything. It's our thank pleasure. You so much. Thank you. All right, goodbye. Okay, and I'll you see you soon, sir. Okay, all right, no goodbye. I'm so happy. All right. Brother. Guys, that was it. Um, we have had good times with the students, the teachers, and all the, all the staff of uh, Mr. Ben Center. And I want to say that this is a center to, to, to visit. So I advise you, you out there who want to study and speak English and even other languages, other subjects, you are a student, you are a professional, Mr. Ben Center is yours. So that was your brother, Seydou C and AKA Wama. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it, and don't forget, next time, is always best time.